Moses walked through the mighty storm, up the mountain towards God. The children of Israel watched the lone figure staggering into the blackness, as the thunder and lightning raged. At the top of the mountain, God told Moses ten things to remember. They were the ten things that make a good or bad person. They were called the Ten Commandments. God said, I am your God, come to me. Moses got to the top, and God told him ten things to remember. The first thing to remember. When you are being good. Is have no other gods, but me. I don't see why you should. The second thing is simple dot. Whatever else you do. Don't worship models made of clay. Don't make an idol in that way. I'd get annoyed with you. In the third commandment. You mustn't ever say. God, Lord or heaven in a joke. For that would spoil my day. The fourth thing you must never do. Upset my Sunday rest. I've given you the other days. To do your work in many ways. On Sunday you can have a lays. And wear your Sunday best. Number five's a good one. Remember what I say. Don't ever upset mom and dad. In any little way. The sixth commandment sure makes sense. I know that when I say no killing is allowed. But then you wouldn't would you? Even when you get annoyed with other men? And don't get your own way. If you are getting married. The seventh rule is this. Don't try and love another. Or give the girls a kiss. At number eight, there's something. I'm sure you'd never do. Don't steal a thing, at any time, from anyone, for any rhyme or reason, as it is a crime. And they would sure capture you. The ninth one to remember. If you do as your bid. Don't blame a man for stealing. Unless you're sure he did. With all the people in the world. Your neighbor is a friend. So don't be jealous even when. You want his goat or horse or hen. For that's commandment number 10. Moses listened open-mouthed as God told him all about the commandments. Can you say it again? I didn't have time to write them down. God said nothing, but waved his mighty hand over Mount Sinai. Lightning flashed, and smoke covered Moses. When it cleared, he saw all the commandments beautifully written on two pieces of stone. Moses thanked God for his help, and began to stagger down the mountain with his commandments. The End